Yes, I had the pleasure of meeting Linda Lovelace. It was at the Playboy Mansion. Uh, it was a, I think, a Midsummer Night's Dream party. And I saw her uh, coming into the mansion about the same time that I was. Uh, Deep Throat had been out for about five months and everybody wanted to say hello to her. She was a, more than a, a household name and she was very nice and she was, uh, she was charming and with considering all of the publicity that she was receiving uh, worldwide, uh, she, she handled it very well. I knew that uh, it had hit the theaters and uh, I was driving down Sunset Boulevard and uh, I'm, I, I'm used to, like anybody else, I'm used to a theater with a new release and maybe the line would be uh, maybe a block or two blocks at, at the most. And I kept driving and uh, I, I reached the second stoplight and there was, the line was still, it was still the same line for the theater. I pulled over and I uh, because I couldn't believe it. I didn't know if there another building had had a fire drill, and that's why all these people were outside. And w when I realized that, th that, that the line was three blocks long and extending around corners and people with lawn chairs, uh, I said, I've got to see the movie. I have to see this.